Hey, in today's video I'm going to be talking about 10 things that pee me off part 2. Number 1 is when uh, I'm watching telly, it's getting late, it's, it's around 11 o'clock, I want to go watch YouTube in my room or something, go go play a game. So I go upstairs to my bedroom, getting tired, falling asleep, doing whatever. So I turn it all off. Put my iPad down, put it on charge, put my laptop down, whatever, yeah, what have you. And as soon as my head hits the pillow, I have the energy of 45 two-year-olds after a party. I'm just not even going to go to sleep that night. But, here's the thing. Take out my iPad, start playing the game, or... Get go on my way and as soon as I play it, as soon as I'm sit, sitting on my bed playing it I'm falling asleep again and it just keeps repeating and repeating until I'm just like whatever, I'm done does my head in, don't even know why I do it why it happens, if you know, comment much appreciated number two is to when I'm going shopping and I need to see what time the bus is coming, so I pull out my phone, check what time it is, put it in my pocket, and I don't know what time it is, even though I've just looked. I do that three or four times, and then like the sixth, and then like the fifth, sixth time I'm like, I'm staring at it, I put it back in my pocket and I still don't know. I think that's down to me not paying attention to what time it is, or looking. It's another thing that I do. To myself that pees me off. Number three is when I'm shopping and I buy food and they ask do you want a bag when I clearly see I need a bag. It's just like why are you asking? I'm like no nah, I'm gonna put it all in my pockets just if I ain't got my bag I'm like yeah if I need one but usually I number four is when I'm when I'm shopping, I need to get round the shops really, really quick because I've got to be somewhere or meet someone or whatever, or I just don't want to be out because I want to go come home and play a game. And there's someone right in front of me, like, here's me, here's the other person. And this person is moving slower than a snail. Like, really slow, and there's no way to get around them. So you shout, oh, excuse, excuse me, ma'am, so whatever. Can I get past, please? And they're like, no, you need to wait, you young people, if they're old, or if they're not around my age, you, you'll be sure of that. And I'm like, I'm standing there like, the hell? What did I do wrong? I asked you to excuse up my way so I can get on with my day. I don't want to be stuck behind you all day. Thank you, and um, bye-bye. Number five. I'm, I'm out and about, so I'm going to the shops or I'm going to meet a friend and listen to music, having a good time, all of a sudden, boom, music stops. Bit of dust. Anyway, the music stops. So I unplug my earphones, see if it's broken or what, plug them in, listening to it, still nothing, so I unplug it. Play the music out loud on my phone to see if it's the actual music app that I use. No, it's not. So I'm trying, and it turns out that my earphones are broken. Yay! So I've got to go for some more. This was before I had my wireless ones. So thank God for them because they're ace, not gonna lie. Now, am I doing video on them? If you're lucky. Number six. It is when I come out, come out, technically I come out from the out, so I come in and I put, hang my coat up, my phone's in my coat pocket, not in my hoodie pocket or my jean pocket or whatever, and I'm sitting down, music's still playing, I'm like, oh I need to find my phone, music's still playing, I need to turn it off, looking, looking, looking around the house, and the last place I look is in my coat, every single time. Except for the one time I left it on the kitchen table, didn't even bother looking there. And I'm looking for it, and because it's wireless, it's the music's playing even if you're not even close to your phone. 
So I'm looking around the house for it. Can't find it. Can't find it anywhere. Always happens. Always, always, always. When am I going to learn? Probably never. Number seven is when I'm on the way home from shopping. Like getting a few bits and bobs. Like, say if I want a, fizzy, a particular fizzy drink, I'd go out and get it. Then that would be at the closest shopping centre place to me. On the way back on the bus, I'm like, oh, I want that. I need to go to, no, I don't know, Tesco or something for, for it. So, so I'm like, gotta go to Tesco to get whatever, to get my sushi. Yeah, I live 15 minute walk from it. And I forget I need to go to Tesco, jump off at the bus and get home, sit down. As soon as I sit in my seat right here, Didn't get Tesco, did I? No, I never. So I have to go all the way up to Tesco to get my sushi. And it's not even there. They don't have the thing I wanted. And I'm like, oh, okay, I'll just walk back home. And I won't get my sushi. Always happens. When I forget, just pees me off, right? Just pees me right off. Eight. When I'm going out for a family meal or something, and I look at my phone, oh, it's on 99%, be fine, just won't use it. I put it in my coat, ready to go out. I leave the house thinking, oh, my phone will be fine, half an hour. Phone will be fine, leaving, phone's fine. I'm out in the car, mum's driving, I don't know, so if we're going for a family meal. And I look, it's on 5%, I'm like, what the hell? So I'm like, fine, I won't listen to my music, I won't text my mates, fine, whatever. On the way there and on the way back, fine, I won't burn in my games. And it's just not fair because I like, my, I like my battery to be at least over 50% when I'm going out. That end, no, it's over 20% when I'm coming home. You know, it's not fair. Why am I the only one that happens to? Comment if it happens to you. Number nine. Number nine. Don't know why I said it funny from my teeth. Teeth. Don't, anyway, don't, when I'm really thirsty, so I grab a drink. No. I grab Pepsi or Coke or whatever we've got. Fizzy drink. I, I, like, I really like fizzy. And I drink I drink a whole glass. Like you just saying, I drink all of that one. Still thirsty. So I'll go pour another one. Still thirsty. So I'll get some water. Still thirsty. I will probably drink. Close to half a litre, and I'm so thirsty, and I have no idea what is wrong with me when I do that. And I find get something to eat, perfectly fine, not thirsty, not hungry. And I'm like, makes no sense unless my body can't tell my brain if it's hungry or thirsty. If it can't. I can't even describe how annoying it is. It's just the poop fest in station. Yes. That's the first words that come to my head. Anyway. It's like, so now I get, I've got to eat a sandwich and a drink and I should be fine. Hopefully it's been working so far. So yeah. Number 10. It's when I'm really, really tired. I'm literally falling asleep. I'm nodding, I'm just doing all that and crap. I'm head rolling. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to go to bed. Drag myself upstairs. Lie on my bed. Head hits the pillow. Going to sleep. Going. Going. Not comfortable. Need the toilet. Need to get a tissue. Forgot my drink in case I wake up thirsty. So I turn on my bedroom light, run downstairs, get a drink, go to toilet, what have you. you know, get get into bed. Yeah. Get all comfy, nice and comfy, nice and warm. Get ready to sleep. Open one eye. For flaps, side the lights on. As soon as I get up to turn that light on, head hits the pillow. I'm gone. Occasionally that happens. Sometimes. I've got to get comfortable, com comfortable again, and I've got to get get another blanket or a quilt or whatever you want to call it, and then I'm happy. I should be happy after that.
it happens all the time and I don't know why it happens. If it happens to you once again, you know what to do. Comment below. Yeah, comment below. Yeah, you. Yeah. Comment. Well, I hope you like this video. It's been so long since I filmed off my iPad as you can probably see because number one, the quality and number two, I keep looking over the um where it says where it's recording and that and how long. Yeah. So it looks like I'm looking at myself but I'm really not. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed this video regardless. Please like yeah or yeah one of them to twin if you're on your phone, iPad or laptop. Anyway, please like, subscribe and before I go, please check out my mates soundcloud music thing he does i don't get soundcloud so i don't know really what it is but the links in the description at the bottom please check him out like if you can like on it give him a shout out share with your friends and i'll see you in the next video bye